Welcome back to Redline TV. We're all the way out in West Virginia at Summit Point Motorsports Park to cover a competition hosted by Redline Time Attack, one of the best time attack organizations in the nation. Redline Time Attack began two years ago to provide a proving ground for the manufacturers of the tuning industry to come out, battle it out, and showcase what their products are actually capable of doing on a customer's free car. Anyone can get into doing it. The idea that that same person can come out here and be running with some of the top teams and manufacturers that he sees in the magazines and, and on TV, it's great. At a Redline Time Attack event, there's everything from monster mod cars to grassroots drivers. I did all the work on my car, uh, did it in the garage. My dad helped me out a little bit, just on jack stands, all out of the wallet, myself. I'm running in modified rear wheel drive class here at Redline Time Attack. Um, the car is a 1995 Nissan 240SX. It was a learning experience and everything feels great so far. Redline Time Attack creates an environment that allows a novice like Sean to comfortably practice and compete without interfering with other drivers of a different skill level, like James Edderman, who brought his Subaru STI all the way from Missouri. This is my 2004 Subaru Impreza. This is actually my second time here. Last year, we competed also at the Redline Time Attack, and I competed in the street all-wheel drive category. This year, we've moved up to the modified all-wheel drive category because we have more power and we also have a little stickier rubber this year with the Neato NT01 tires. This car and many others are getting ready for the Time Attack competition, so don't go away. 